Hello guys, in this episode of Blender Quick Tips, I'll share how using inset can actually be a better idea than using extrude. But real quick guys, if you're looking for reckons to be the best 3D modeling tutorial on the internet, I recommend checking out my Udemy course. It's got tutorials on Blender, 3ds Max, CAD programs such as Plasticity and Moai 3D, and a lot of ZBrush as well. So if you want to master a variety of programs to really bring your skills up to the next level and master 3ds Max, Blender, ZBrush, and Plasticity, be sure to check out that course, link is in the description. Let's continue. So guys, one of my favorite tools in 3ds Max here, where I got the idea for this, is the bevel tool in 3ds Max allows me to both extrude and inset at the same time, which is a very nice function for getting more freeform interesting details, as opposed to just extrude, which just goes straight up or straight down. Now in Blender, so I've got this, let me just, uh, subdivide this now in blender if we use extrude it pretty much goes straight down here now in blender there don't seem to be any options to inset as well so we got flip normals we got offset which is just this dissolve that so we don't really have that option in blender here so here's what we have to do instead if you use inset Notice how now I'm using inset. At the top, notice how it says control to tweak the depth. So if you hold down control, guys, you're essentially gonna get the same tool as in 3ds Max. So if you hold control, that's your extrusion. That's your upward or inward. And then once you let go of control, you set the inset as well. So I think this tool is actually better than just using the default extrude because Let's say I wanted to make this more interesting. Well, I would either have to scale this or I would have to inset, then select this, then control X to remove that. I have to go through all that guys. But with inset, we get both this. And if you hold down control, we get this as well. So I actually think guys, you should probably use inset as opposed to extrude if you want more interesting details. I think that's the way to go. Alright, thank you for watching and take care.